Well, early on, the band came to me and said, you know, we want this to, we want to experiment with different kinds of technology. We want to see what we can do in new dimensions. What's exciting about Mando Diao has been their capacity to reinvent themselves, to change, to experiment. We started very early on with, um, with photography, with film, with video. And at the same time, we got the opportunity and were introduced to our 3D technique. And that's when the band jumped on and said, this is, that's another dimension. It's another technology that we can explore. I thought it was fantastic. Some great songwriting and some really interesting approaches to electronic music. I was able to add virtual realities to music. With our 3D, we could put instruments and vocals in places where you'd never expect them. It's just great. It is maybe, you could say, how music is meant to be listened to. Um, I think it's, it's so effectful. It's like when you have noise and then you have silence. And right in the middle of that thing, everything just went shoo, down to the voice right there. And then because then the space becomes a space. It's making use of the arrangement and placing that in such a way that it starts doing that by itself. There's so many things. I think I'd have to listen 50 times to hear that's, everything. That's a journey. <laughs> yeah. It's a discovery. You know, it's angels singing from above and behind you to guitars that are going back and forth. It separates things. It allows you to, to feel an environment all around you. You build tension, you build uh, unexpectedness. You can build up from not just in volume and dynamics, but you can build up by direction and moving it forward to a focus. That's awesome. With this kind of music, sometimes voices come from above and they sound like angels and sometimes uh, a knife flies through the air, uh, through the air, and makes a circle. I describe it as uh, making a choreography for ten loudspeakers. And that, that in the stereo mix, you don't get that effect at all. That that song is gone, or that yeah, it, it's there, but it just, just but that that sounds like you dropped a rock in a pond and it just goes. Brrr. Yeah. And the moment it opens, that's when you hear it move. Okay, yeah. It moves the whole time. It's the arrangement that makes it go bigger, 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 bigger. It would be really interesting, like you talked about, to just flip over right in the middle of that, the stereo, and just feel it. Just dunk, dunk, there it is. There's the, there's the stereo mix. And then, oh, here it is, here's the, <laughs> because it is, it is, it is uh, like a sphere around you. It's, it's cool. For me today, I heard things that I'd never heard before. That's what we'd like to be able to deliver to all of our, our consumers, um, all of the fans. We, I would like everybody to hear what I hear today, and if that means we can do it in an application with headphones, awesome. Technicians want to make it as natural as it can be. We need to put the technology in the hands of artists to let them see what they can do with it. Because when, when you can take technology and you can twist it, tweak it, turn it upside down on its head and get something out of it that you never anticipated, that's when it's exciting. wanted to do some videos in Japan because Japan is what people thought the future would be like <laughs> and it is it's a it's a, a future vision of the world and so what the next thing for Mando Diao is going to be I can't I can't say yet they were talking about this last week that uh, they're going to record their next album at the North Pole and <laughs> that wouldn't surprise me <laughs>